the the Bible talks strongly. You should really read the Bible. <laughs> God judges those who commit child sacrifice. I appreciate your right to be out here and do this, but mm -hmm. have you ever considered that requiring men to have abortions would be a good solution to the problem you're having? What do you mean? Men to have abortions? No, vasectomies. Oh, vasectomies. Every man gets a vasectomy. Well, I mean, I'm for reproductive justice. I don't think we should, you know, control who can re reproduce. Well, then why are we doing it to women? Well, why are no. you advocating doing it to women? Well, I'm just saying we shouldn't murder babies. Like that's that's it. I I, I think our okay. our laws against murder yeah. should be applied equally to born and unborn to people. Unborn embryos. Yes, they're I mean they're human, okay. and they're living. Gotcha. So, I mean. But well, the way so, to solve it is not get pregnant in the first place, and if men have vasectomies, then they can't do that. Yeah, well, I mean, it's we could silly also... silly is what you're asking. Well, I don't think it's silly at all to not murder people. No, no, no. So, so is the, are you saying the, the pre-born isn't human? They're not. They're well, not human. When do they become human? When they're the born. Birth, the Bible says at the first breath. No. Yes. There's no mention of abortion in the Bible. There's, well, it mentions child sacrifice. Abortion is child sacrifice. I don't know what you're saying. Yeah, I mean, definitely, it is yeah. Not. There's no mention of abortion in the Bible. Not one. Not one. I don't know. Yeah, okay, well, it doesn't say that. the word abortion. Right. But they didn't there's have a. Abortions. Yeah, and there, there's a it lot of things. It doesn't say anything about killing a baby in the womb. Well, there is a law in Leviticus that if someone, like, if two men get into a fight and a woman gets mixed in that's pregnant and her baby. <laughs> Is born and it dies. Born. They are they to be. Born and then dies. Okay, so w so when That's would you say abortion. when would you say a, a baby becomes a human? At the first breath, like when. Uh, so like the Bible says. But life begins at first breath. Okay, so so breath is magical and it bestows human rights. Yes, it does. It is magical. So babies are still processing breath, oxygen in the womb. Is life. Uh, okay, so Jesus entered the womb. He didn't, he didn't, like, Mary, but if what you're saying well, is true, Mary I, could have aborted Jesus. Well, I think you're but, totally out base. And another thing, you don't have a uterus, you don't have ovaries. What gives you the right to tell anybody I'll tell you, how they should Do you think, do you think slavery life? was wrong? Do you think enslaving black people was wrong? Of course. Did, well, do you own slaves? You, you can't, you can't it's say wrong. that's wrong. Oh, but you don't own slaves, so you can't have that opinion. Uh, it's the same logic. People, I mean, people it would say this. Not. Slave owners hey, would say this. They would say, "My property, I've my prerogative." A, I've never had an abortion. How about you? You've never had an abortion. Why can you tell people what they should do? Because I think we can we can look at things and we can we can make moral judgments about things even yeah, if we haven't okay. done them ourselves. On your side, but anyone else has, not, doesn't have that right. That's exactly. No, no what I didn't. Saying. I didn't That's say that. That's hypocrisy. What There's did I say? People can't make judgments. Because I've never had a slave. No, so look, I can't say that was that I wasn't actually making that, that point. I was I was making that comparison because you don't you didn't agree with it. I'm saying what you were saying and what but I what proposed. You're is hypocrisy. You don't have a uterus. You have no ovaries. Yeah. Why should you dictate to women what they can do with their own body? Because like freedom like, is body autonomy. You're taking away Okay, yeah, I agree with right that. Is taking away their freedom. Women are not sex objects. Babies are not body parts. Well, then get a vasectomy. If you don't want an abortion, don't have one. But you have no right to tell people to follow your your religion just because you believe in it. They might believe something else. Okay, well, what if somebody doesn't, they just don't believe that murder well, is wrong? You have the right to. So why, why is religion. murder wrong, just you in general? You have the right, because the Bible talks about that. Okay. Okay, so why why should we press the Bible on people? Well, the Bible doesn't. There's nothing about abortion in the Bible. But well, no, you got to be consistent. Murder. There is about murder. Yeah, and it also and says that God knits us together in the womb. It doesn't. It doesn't now, say. What, what now, verse? Give me a verse. You said. You said first breath. What verse? Are you recording all the conversations that yes, people sir. have with you? Yes, sir. May, mostly for protection, like because people will accuse me of like shouting people down or getting violent. And I'm, I'm just out here to have these, the these kind of conversations. Huh? Mostly is only part of it. 
Well, the sorry. protection is mostly with oh. the rest. Yeah, oh, like if I have good conversations with people, then yeah, we'll share them because okay. they can be edifying to others, but. Yeah, well, don't use our conversations. Well, I mean, it's public, public property. The, there's no reasonable right to privacy. Well, you didn't inform me that you had that on. You did not inform us. Well, it's, I don't have to. You're in, you're in yes, public. Yes, you do. No, there, there's no reasonable right to privacy in public. Is he taking pictures of you too while it's yes. going on? Yes, sir. Uh, that's funny. All right, carry on. All right. I'm just saying the, the Bible talks you strongly. Read, you should really read the Bible. <laughs> God judges those who commit child sacrifice. God hates the worship of those who allow child sacrifice. You need to repent, ma'am. Is as strong as thunder will be heard across the land, calling to the magistrates to save a neighbor man.